Do you have a narcissistic parent? Do they not take accountability for anything? Are you considering cutting them off? Hi, I'm Ben, a certified parent cutter offer. And today I'm here with a three-step guide on how you can cut ties with your parent. Before I get into these three steps, the way I done it was the easiest way. So if you'd like to do this, all you have to do is create a TikTok account and post videos talking about your traumatic childhood experiences and your mother will find them and then cut you off. And she'll phone the police about your TikTok. Number one, numero uno. I would always encourage repairing or building the relationship first before going no contact, even though that responsibility is not on you. Tell your parents how you feel. Say things like, this doesn't need to be an argument. I don't mean any disrespect or offense to you, but as your child, I want you to understand my feelings of what I went through. If they don't take accountability, <laughs> or they don't validate your feelings, or they try and turn it on them like the narcissist that they are, then we go to number two. Numero dos. Step number two is putting boundaries in place. If you speak to your parents once a day, cut that contact to once a week, once every other day. If every time you are around your parents, they just suck the soul out of you, then do yourself a favor by finally putting your own peace first and limiting that contact with them. If they don't respect your boundaries, we go to number three. Numero tres. Step three is when we cut contact. And this is hard because you have a conflict within you. Your inner child is saying we still need this parent and child relationship, but the adult version of you is saying if I cut contact, it's going to be easy because they don't feel like parents anyway. What I would recommend is writing a letter. If you end the relationship on an argument, the feeling that lingers is resentment and anger. Whereas if you write a letter or a text from a point of peace and say, I'm finally choosing peace, nothing against you. I don't need to understand my feelings, but I'm choosing peace and to allow peace to enter my life and to have an abundance of peace, I can't have contact with you. And I wish you all the best. The feeling that lingers is peace. And that's what you want. You want peace. Hope this helps. Gracias, mi amigos.